digital breast tomosynthesis better than mammography in breast cancer detection. Digital breast tomosynthesis creates a three-dimensional picture of the breast using X-rays. It is relatively new, and available only at limited number of hospitals. Digital breast tomosynthesis is approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Digital breast tomosynthesis differ from a standard mammogram, in the same way like a court scan and standard X-ray. One is three-dimensional, the other is flat, difference like a ball and a circle. Mammography usually takes two X-rays of each breast from different angles, top to bottom and side to side. The breast is pulled away from the body, compressed, and held between two glass plates to ensure that the whole breast is viewed. Regular mammography records the pictures on film, and digital mammography records the pictures on the computer and read by a radiologist. Breast cancer, which is denser than most healthy nearby breast tissue, appears as irregular white areas or shadows. Mammograms are very good, but they have some significant limitations. Some women hate the compression of the breast which is uncomfortable. Compression causes overlapping of the breast tissue and cancer can be missed. Mammograms take only one picture, across the entire breast, in two directions. It's like standing outside the forest, looking for a bird somewhere inside, instead of going inside and search. Digital breast tomosynthesis is a new kind of test that's trying to overcome all these three big issues. It takes multiple x-ray pictures of each breast from many angles. Breast is positioned between two glass plates, with little pressure, just enough to keep it in a stable position during the procedure. The X-ray tube moves in an arc around the breast while 11 images are taken during a 7-second examination. The information is sent to a computer, where it is assembled to produce clear, highly focused three-dimensional images throughout the breast. A three-year study of more than 33,000 patients from 2011 onwards is presented by Emily Conant, MD, Professor of Radiology and Chief of Breast Imaging at the University of Pennsylvania Medical Center in Philadelphia. The Radiological Society of North America 2015 Annual Meeting on November 30, 2015. They found a significant reduction in recall rates, an increase in cancer detection rates, an increase in positive predictive values, a decrease in the interval cancer rate, most useful in decreasing the false positive rate. The biopsy rate remained relatively stable. The team found tomosynthesis is useful for detecting not only prevalent cancers, but incident cancers also, that makes it a useful modality for annual screening and not just for one-time use. Tomosynthesis is more sensitive than standard mammography and detect the cancers even inside dense breast tissue. This makes breast screening more comfortable and productive. Digital breast tomosynthesis definitely revolutionize breast imaging. Hope you found it useful. 
For more information please click the link in description.